now that you've taken some videos or images, where are all those pictures on your iPad? So right next to the camera, you have something. It's a little flower with all different types of colors. That's the photos. And so I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to click inside there. And right away, what you notice is that I have December 28th, 2020, Germantown and more, it says. And so you can see that there's pictures that are labeled from Germantown because I went down to Top Golf on December 28th and took some images. Now, I did not take my iPad with me to Top Golf. I used my phone, and because I have iCloud set up, um, all of my pictures from my phone come over to my iPad. And so that's why I have that iCloud storage that I talked about earlier. So in the top menu, I can see that I have all photos. I can also go to days. And so I could go Monday. I could go Wednesday. That's our, our puppy. And you can see there under Monday, there are 10 pictures or 10 total pictures. So I can go ahead and I can click that. And it's going to pull up all those pictures from December 28th. Go back to days. So this was taken Wednesday. And there was one other one taken on Wednesday. That's the one right next to it. I can go to months. So I can go December if I wanted to. There's November, there's October, September, August, July, and then so on and so forth. Or I can go years. So I can go all the way back to 2012. And that picture there in 2012, those students are now uh, halfway through their freshman year in college. So that's when they were in fifth grade. So that's always nice. And the 2013 pictures, the class just graduated uh, as a I guess a graduation ceremony like everybody else in the country at a certain time. So that is the menu on the top that I was looking at. Over on the left hand side, I have other menus. And so it may look one of two ways. It may look like this. Or if I click in the top left hand corner, you kind of see that little square. There's a line through it. I can click on that and it kind of makes that disappear. So when I click that back, there's my library. Um, and I can go down and I can say for me. And so this is taking those 14 photos from Germantown. I, Apple does things really well in that they make videos for you. So this is just a, when we went to Citizens Bank Park, um, they put together a video. I didn't put together Go Team Philadelphia, they did that. September 27th, 2019, we went down to University of Maryland to watch Penn State um, play Maryland in football. And those are all the pictures that were taken on that particular day. So they put together a video of it. And so they did that again. And Aiden and I went to Lily World Series. This was in the North Atlantic Ocean when we were on a cruise in 2019. And here's another one from 2014. So that's what that for you is. And you can go ahead and you can play those if you wanted to. Um, and it's just there. Moving right down, I have people. Um, I have identified people in my pictures and you can see who I've identified. And the one thing I want you to pay particular close attention to is I have Aiden there as one of the people and then I have him again. And notice that he's changed a little bit because of his glasses. Um, Apple has not, or at least I don't know how, that they can switch that to make it so Aiden is also Aiden because of his, his change. And so that's there. Um, but what I can do is I can click on this Aiden with the glasses and any picture of Aiden with his glasses on will appear here. And I can hit show more and there's all the different pictures of him with his glasses on. So, and I can add the name to it if I wanted to. So I can name this. I can hit done. And now notice that that's there. I could do the same thing for my wife. And so I'll show more. And these are all the pictures that have her in it. And so you can see how that works. Um, I can go down one more step and I can go to places. So you can see 1,189 pictures were taken probably around here. Um, four were taken in the Atlantic Ocean. If I go all the way out to the left, um, 40 were taken in Arizona. And then it looks like one was taken in Texas. So you can see kind of because I have enabled location services um, for my pictures. That's why that's there. I have favorites and I can favorite any picture. If I go back to my library, if I go back to, let's say, this one, and I look at this picture, I can 